There's all these detrimental consequences that happen, obviously for overweight, but that can also happen if we're at our ideal weight or normal weight or even underweight. If it's true that a lot of people who are thin are also metabolically unhealthy, then what is all that about? In fact, it may be up to 30% of people who are thin are also what we call metabolically obese normal weight or TOFI, thin on the outside, fat on the inside. I call it skinny fat. They look skinny, but they're actually fat on the inside. And their risks, it turns out, are as bad as those who are overweight and actually maybe even higher. In some diabetic studies, they found that thin diabetics are at higher risk of complications and death than overweight diabetics, which is very concerning. So you know, sometimes people are thin in terms of the scale, but if you look at them, they got a little pooch or a little belly. And you see this particularly in certain populations like Asians or Indians from India are often at their ideal weight, but they still have high rates of diabetes, even when they're not overweight. And that's because they are prone to develop this organ fat, this visceral fat, this belly fat. And this is really terrible <laughs> because uh, they may have a low body mass index. So on their weight scale, they look fine, but they have not enough muscle and they have poor metabolic health because their muscle is metabolically unhealthy as well. So not only do they have lower muscle mass and are under lean, but their muscle quality is lower. So even if you're thin, it doesn't mean you got a free ticket.